Whoa. It's so sunny that it looks like I've dyed my hair. Damn. But I didn't. It's just a beautiful weather. I thought that it's a perfect time to... You can see that I'm vlogging on the phone. Uh, it's a perfect time to let you know about another project that I'm going to start. And it is the ultimate daily. You probably already know which car I'm talking about. So let's go and watch it. Yes, this is my current daily. I kind of lost a lot of money on this build, which did not work as expected, but I don't want to like stop working on cars. So yeah, I'm, I'm intending to bring this car back to the glory. Uh, yeah, it didn't ever have and work on it. Well, fix it. Yeah, that's the game plan. Okay, let's get to work. Let's go. I wanted to start with something that bothers me a lot. That ugly bumper and fogged headlamp. I will replace the lamp since I have a spare one. A lot better. Here I want to apologize for the video quality. It is my old camera and I promise that the footage will get better with Canon I bought. We're gonna weld some plastic. Everything on that bumper is broken, so we gotta fix it. Welding plastic is not that difficult. All you need is a soldering iron and some filler. Just make sure it is the same material as your bumper. I will make a separate video about it. When I was done with welding, I put the bumper back on the car and it made such a difference. It's still ugly, but it's better than it was before. I wouldn't say that it's perfect, but it's a lot better.
Now brake pads. What is odd is that I changed rear pads half a year ago and they already gone. And I know that brake discs need replacement but it was just a temporary fix. Last time I didn't hide the brake pad wear sensor correctly, so it looks like this right now. And with rear brakes sorted, I finished for the day. One of the things you will see me do is swap things over from the silver car to my blue car. And one of them is, one of those things is the windshield squirters. The thing that, the nozzles for the washing fluid. And right now, the washing fluid stream looks like this. And after just swapping over to the new ones, it looks like this. For someone, it's nothing for me, it's a lot. I like the spray pattern, the new spray pattern that I have, and it does a better job. Now the sway bar connecting rod. It broke the previous day on my way home and I managed to get a replacement really fast thanks to my friend Marek. Right now it's time for front brake pads, starting with removing this lock spring to unbolting caliper and swapping pads for replacement ones. This video was only a quick introduction to a new project and since it's my daily I needed it to make a better job at being daily. I will take care of more stuff re related to the car in more details in future episodes. Right now I wanted to thank you for watching, um, remember to like and comment the video to help me grow the channel, stay safe, hydrated and have fun, bye!